Hello. Hola. And bonjour, everyone. It's Matthew. And Doug. From McCroyo Bros Bodybuilding. MB3. Three. And today, we're here with you to talk about triceps. Yep. All right, so when we train triceps, obviously there's three heads to the tricep, and you want to hit all three to make maximum growth. And for us, what we like to do is we like to start out our workout with, I mean, usually just a couple warm-up sets, but then usually a mass building exercise because you don't want to just right off the bat usually isolate it unless you're just like warming them up. Mm -hmm. Those isolation exercises are going to get you tired out so you can't give it your all on these big mass building, especially when we're bulking and trying to gain size. And the mass building, obviously, it's more of a compound movement where it's using other things as well, such as close grip bench press or dips, dips, or overhead extensions with a barbell or. Mm -hmm. uh, so yeah, a uh, really good, probably one of our favorite mass building uh, exercise for triceps is dips. Just because, I mean, I know it's a lot of people's favorites, but it's our favorites just because. It hits all heads. Mm, and especially because then you can strap weights to yourself and I mean, it's just overall, obviously, we've seen over time that it's a great exercise, it's what you read everywhere, and it's one of our key builders to our triceps. Mm -hmm. And then after the mass building exercise, like the first exercise in our workout, we go to work the long head. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and that's just because um, that's the biggest head in your tricep so you want to work your biggest just like we we're working the overall tricep first now we go to the next biggest and work from there it's all about like priority kind of and the long head that's going to give you a nice thick like mass look especially from behind and it's going to give you the biggest size on your tricep comparatively to the lateral head mm -hmm. And a good exercise for the long head would be like overhead extensions. Maybe you could have cables on a rope over your head or even just dumbbells or even a barbell. Mm. All of them are great. And then we move on to the lateral head of the tricep. What we like to work usually last in our tricep yeah. workout. So a good exercise for that would be like finishing off your workout with like rope push downs that's a good one for the lateral head and another way like let's say your lateral head is lagging a little bit maybe at the end do some rope press downs with a rope and when you go down you're gonna want to bring your wrists out and lock out and really squeeze but if they're lagging behind one way that you could try to bring them up is doing a couple of drop sets on the press downs mm -hmm. drop sets are always key for basically anything mm -hmm. And yeah, like he was saying, when you're down to kind of turn your hands out, really to hit just the lateral head. And then when you come up, instead of, I see people raise it up and kind of almost rest up here. I come up just to where your forearm is parallel with the ground and then right back down and just keep it like that so it's constant tension on the muscle. And you could even, uh, if you want to really isolate the tricep, the lateral head is not have anything on the cable and just the little rubber ball that goes on the end of it and hold it just in one hand and just go one hand at a time and go down and just turn out your wrist and it really, you have to try it out. It really yeah, does. I was, we'll have a clip of this actually. I was showing some of my friends at the gym. I like to grab that ball and kind of bring it across your body like this. Instead of a regular push down, bring it across your body like that and that just even more targets the lateral head this outer head there which is good for any poses basically and for the popping out of the tricep and remember guys your tricep is two-thirds of your arm compared to your bicep so if you want big arms this is really what you need to work rather than just being a curl monkey and working biceps all yeah the time. nobody likes to go to the gym and see a curl monkey at least we don't. Oh, let me tell you. <laughs> it grinds my gears, and they're wasting their time because while big biceps obviously are impressive, they're a lot smaller of a muscle than even your tricep. I mean, it only mm -hmm. has two heads, and your tricep has three heads. Yep, so make sure you're all around, basically in bodybuilding, you just want to work every single muscle evenly to get them all proportional to one another. Exactly, and just remember also on triceps, 
a big thing with them is when you lock out to squeeze. It's kind of like with any muscle that you obviously want to squeeze it, but the lockout, I'd say, out of any muscle is one of the most important on the tricep. It's kind of odd because most things like legs, you never want to lock out your legs just for safety reasons and things. But for the triceps, it's actually the opposite. You want to lock out as far as possible. Alright guys, so I hope you liked the video. Speaking of that, you can like the video. You can throw down a comment. And even subscribe. But remember guys, there's always more on the way. So, stay tuned. And watch out for our supplement review videos coming up soon. Very soon. Check us out on Facebook, Twitter. Have a nice day.